In this video, I'm going to be outlining steps on how to create video content for your classroom. This includes scripting, video capture, and editing. Using videos can go a long way towards engaging a student population that is accustomed to movies or YouTube clips. This introduction should help you feel comfortable with taking the director's chair. The first thing to do is to script your content. Treat it like writing a storyboard. Even if you're familiar with what you'll be presenting, scripting gives you the chance to format the material in a way that is most useful to your audience. For example, this script has been broken up by scene. Each scene represents a discrete concept to be expressed in the video. Once you're done scripting, it's time to choose a recording platform. I'm going to show you two, but there are many more options to explore. Screencast-O-Matic is a free, web-based screen grab software. What do I mean by screen grab? Well, you simply click the big blue button and grab the section of the screen you want to record. When you're done, either upload your video to YouTube or download as an MP4. The other option for Mac owners is to use QuickTime. After opening up QuickTime in your Applications folder, click File, then click New Screen Recording. You'll see a pop-up that looks like this. Click the red button and choose the section on the screen you want to capture. Then click the red button again to begin recording. When you're finished, you'll click that same red button to stop the process. Then you can save it on your hard drive for editing. The final step is to edit your video. We could do a whole series on just editing, but for the beginner, all you will need to edit are the ends and the beginnings of your video. The best bet if you're starting out is to use iMovie. You can import your video and easily slice off the ends with a few easy mouse strokes. To learn more about any part of the video creation process, please contact us at ctrltlr at american.edu. Thank you for watching.